Hi, Scott Austin here from Austin's Wines. I'm the uh, managing director and owner of Austin's Wines. I joined this business in the year 2004 and I'm a second generation member of the Austin family. Austin's Wines was founded in 1982 by uh, my parents, Richard and Pamela. They decided to get into the wine business basically through a passion for wine. They were working in the clothing industry at the time, but uh, purchased the property of a small property of three acres uh, and planted some Riesling, Chardonnay and Cabernet. And the reason they uh, did this was because they wanted to make a wine that they could share with their friends and be proud of. Richard and Pam got fairly serious about their wine in the early 1990s when they purchased a 1,500 acre property in the Moorable Valley region of Geelong. The Geelong region has a wonderful history. It's actually one of the oldest grape growing regions in Australia, which is a little known fact. It was originally planted by the Swiss in the 1860s when they settled here. They identified this region as a wonderful area, cool climate, beautiful place for, for growing grapes. Well, here at Austin's Wines, we do produce two ranges, Austin's and Six Foot Six. The Austin's is our flagship wine. It's really designed uh, to work in unison with food, and it's a beautiful product made in a Burgundian style, but with New World fruit, so not overimposing on that fruit. Um, we generally like to age our Austin's. I hold them back a little bit so they get nice bottle age and they've got some wonderful complex characters about them. The other brand that we released in 2004, just when I joined the business, was Six Foot Six. That's this product here. Uh, it's designed for a bit more fun, earlier drinking, more of an everyday kind of wine. My name's Scott Island, and uh, I'm the winemaker for Austin's Wines. I've uh, been making wine here for them for the last eight years. I've been in the Geelong region since 1994 was my first vintage here. That's after I started working in the Barossa Valley as a young bucket in 1981 and then travelled around the world, a couple of vintages in France, a couple of vintages in California. The Pinot Noir that is planted here at Austin's is planted in uh, terrific conditions. Uh, the soils are similar to the Terra Rossa soils of the uh, famed Coonawarra region. The combination of the climate, the rainfall and these soils, when the right clones of Pinot Noir are planted, mean that we can get fruit into the winery here that gives us the opportunity to make great wine. The Chardonnay. Lots of riff, rich, lifted, sort of peach type fruit with a uh, uh, cashewy influence from uh, barrel ferment and, and maturation in French oak barrels. Freshness is a key to wine and, and this wine has that has all that flavour I'm talking about and, and just power but it's all kept in check by the right acid line driving through. Natural acid uh, because of when we harvested the grapes is a real key to this wine. That's the Chardonnay. Austin's Pinot Noir. Lots of lifted red berry fruit flavours, so raspberries, strawberries, those sorts of things, not blackberries. We're not looking at black fruits here, we're looking at red fruits, which we believe is what uh, Pinot Noir is all about. And a, a fine line of clove-like French oak influence there, maturation in French oak barrels once again. All those flavours come through on the palate, on the front palate, but again, there's a, a nice spine of natural acid and tannin uh, that drives through the back of the wine, wine, keeping it tight, keeping it focused, driving through the long length of flavour. Cheers. I hope you're all enjoying the Armit Spring Trade tasting. I've been working with uh, John Armit Wines for a number of years now and thoroughly enjoyed every minute of it. People are fantastic. I have a great time every time I come over there, not to mention the fact that they're very good sellers of my wine and I know they enjoy it because a few of them have been over, over here to sample it for themselves first hand and to even pick some grapes. So enjoy the wines, get round to our stand, I'll be there in a couple of months and hopefully I'll come visit your store or your restaurant with one of the reps soon.